But there was a notification that said that my raft drifted really far away and it'll be lost during this session if not recovered. They gotta be talking about that piece that we threw out into the ocean a while back, a couple episodes ago. My raft right here is doing just fine. So I wish they'd hurry up and delete it. So it'd be gone from the server. But they keep promising that they're gonna get rid of it, but empty threats so far. So I think I'm gonna just make a couple extra spears here. So we have them. Yeah, I might get two stacks of spears. I guess it's probably never a bad thing to have extra spears. Let's do a little run around the island. Let's see if we can see anything that sort of pops out. Any resources, planks, cloth, that sort of stuff. Uh, poisonous things. There's a boat out there. We'll probably have to check that out with our raft. Probably be the safer option. Rather than try to swim out there. Oh, there's a crab right there. There's another one over there as well. So we're going to stay away from them. Just grabbing some rocks. It's really good for crafting. Now the main purpose is to find engine components for the gyrocopter. But uh, if we find things like this laying around, we'll grab some of those too. We can always head on, head on back to our island. Drop things off and come back. Do more. Go off on different directions. Let's see if we have a crate in here. I don't think... No, no, doesn't look like it. I see bubbles out here, so we'll have to definitely visit that. But I want to take... Is this a separate... That might be the same boat. It's a pretty tall mass. So make sure we're not being tailed by the, the crabs. Looks like they're... Yeah, it looks like they're just sort of hanging out there. There's two actually bubbles right there and there. So we got a couple places that could be looted. Oh, more bubbles out here too. Yeah, let's go get our... Let's go get our... Now that the weather's cleared, we can see a little bit deeper in the water. Let's go grab ourselves our raft and... Yeah, he's coming after me. He's coming after me. Not giving up. He's determined. Let's pull this up. Otherwise, it'll be a little hard to drag out. Let's see. I'm going to put these rocks just in one of these loose containers because if they go overboard, I'm not that worried about it. It's not like it's a rare engine component. So that's what we'll do there. Let me see here. Um, I'll keep that on me for now. Yeah. Got a couple extra rocks there. What about right here? Let's throw the cloth in there. Oh, can I kill you from here? That'd be an easy way to kill you. Be rid of you forever. I'm not really planning on going back on the island. So we'll probably, once we're done here, we should be good. Let's see here. Tab. These are all filled with stuff. What about here? It's pretty empty. Someone said, hey, you could use the lantern on the boat. I wonder if we can, we can hang it anywhere. Let me make sure I'm not going to get stung by this thing. Maybe I can hang it on something? You're saying? I, I'm not sure. To help illuminate things at night. But uh, I could just probably just drop it here and it should be fine. But I'm going to put it back here for now. We'll experiment with that a little bit later. Now, hold on. Get it out of my hand. There we go. And we have an extra rock. Why were we carrying I thought, I thought I already put all the rocks in there. Apparently not quite. There we go. Got rid of that. Here's a cloth. Okay, let's stack that cloth on that one. And I'm going to go ahead and probably drink some of this. Yeah. There we go. Let me rotate here. I just had the two. No, I had three. Okay, so we're hydrated again. It's like, uh, all right. Much better. So let's stow this. Make sure that the sail is up. That way we don't have our boat take off from us. Now, something else somebody said in the comments was you could rotate the, the sail in order to catch the wind better. They said Q and E, but E is that. And Q and R, does they don't do anything. Neither do the arrow keys. So I'm not sure how to rotate the sail. And maybe it has to be down to do that. Nope, there's nothing saying I can do anything with it when it's down, so... I'm not sure what you guys are talking about. 
But let's get this off the rocks here and move over to to this ship and see if we can find anything worthwhile to help us out a little bit. All right. Let's immediately get this away from this little bit of sand here. There we go. I think we're good. I think we cleared. Yep, I think we cleared it pretty well. Let's head over here, see what these bubbles are all about. There's some rocks in front of us. We're gonna move move a little bit. Having these having these storage containers loosely strewn about the uh, deck of the ship make it a little bit harder to see directly in front of me. Got the I got the visibility of a Camaro basically. Okay, let's see here. I wanna see where I can see some. Let's try not to run into the mast or into whatever this is right here. Was that the bow? Okay, there's some bubbles right there. All right, let's get off the ship. We got the anchor down. Let's put this up for extra safety. Yeah, it's nice and dark in here now. Let's, mm, okay, let's go straight down. Okay. How do I get down here? Whoa, hey, Manta Ray. What do we got down here? Oh, we do have a... It's in here. Oh, we'll take that for sure. Nice. Let's go get some air. Let's go figure out what we want to do with this. Just drop that there for now. And I'm going to take this one off and I'm just going to sort of drop it over here. Pick this one up and we'll put it here on this. So now it's nice and secure. Wonderful. Let's double check, make sure these are all empties. They are just rocks in that one. No big deal. Okay. These are starting to get a little choppy. All right, so we got the container out of there. Anything else that can be had? I don't see any other bubbles. Do you guys see any other bu 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 bubbles? <laughs> it's a difficult word to say. Oh, there's some right there. It's down there. Oh, it's the front of the ship. in here. It's dark in here. Oh, it's like a kitchen. A label maker. We don't need that. Get out of here with that noise. Anything else? It is dark. Toilet? Alright, let's get to the surface. We need oxygen. I hate, I hate the dark water. That's just... So hard to see anything in there. Okay. Sail stowed in case we have problems here. All right. Let's release it. Let's not fall off the boat right now. And then let's sail to the other side of the island. I think we're starting to get too many containers on the boat. Probably gonna have to drop a couple of these. Oh, I see some bubbles right out here, straight ahead. Yeah, I'm gonna end up missing things if I keep stacking containers like this haphazardly. Oh, there's a couple of bubbles. Okay. So we got two bubbles here. Try to get as close to on being on top of these as possible. That's not too bad. We'll take it. That's getting to be nighttime. That's that's the issue there. I kinda wanna sleep till morning, but at the same time I kinda wanna get going. Let's uh let's use that maybe we can use the old lantern. Maybe that'll work. Can I carry that with me? In my hand? Will it work underwater? Okay. What's down here? Oh, it does help. See thing. Okay, so it's, it's, it is just a... Take that. Take that whole thing. Oh, this lantern actually works really good. Take that. Oh, another one. 
little glitchy, but we'll take it. Okay, so we got three of these now. Oh, that's the, the wrong way. Wrong way, Corrigan. Okay. So, we have so many, so many containers. I'm going to have to start deep six in some of these. I know they're important to have, but geez. Take a look here. I'm just going to drop three of these. Let's get that label maker out of here. We've already got one back at base. So, into the deep you go. See, our, our raft is starting to go underwater, I think, actually. Now, can these stack? I bet they can. Yeah, they totally can. Uh, we got lashing. I think we had more lashing here. We're starting to stack some things. Lashing. Or, I should say leather. But now we have lashing. So, now overall, we... Actually got some pretty stackable things. And I'm going to put this down here. So we got flare gun. Illumination devices, basically, is all. Everything there in the bottom. That one's empty. Nope. Did not mean to pick that up. So he hit my he hit my boat right there. That's what that was. That's that. Uh, I'm going to drop this one right here. Let that go back down into the deep. I'm going to take up. Grabbed the one I really want there. And we'll attach it. Oops. Ah! If the pitching deck will stop. There we go. So there, there, there. Not too bad. I think we can stack this, though, down here. Right here. Alright. Much better. Just organizing a little bit here. Is that fuel filter part? Thought we had one of those over here somewhere. Another one of these. Might be able to... It will. Yep. It'll go four deep. Leather. Uh, we do have we do have a flare gun over here, down here in the bottom or somewhere. It's like playing the matching game. Oh, I have it in my hand. Let's try this again. There we go. We might head on back to our base and offload a lot of this stuff here, since we are getting a little heavy. But I think what we'll do is we'll check these these bubbles out over here before we do that. And so I'll release that. I'll get on the rudder before I release the anchor. It's a safety safety thing. Let's head over this way. Yeah, it's getting a it's getting a bit nightmarish to navigate with. Oh, there they go. There they go. Into the deep. We knew that was going to happen. No big deal. That's why I didn't put anything important in there. Those should have all been empties. So, yeah. We have some empties here as well. Well, except for the stones. Oh, my stones. And I think we're on top of the bubbles, actually. Let's get that lantern. Kind of like that lantern a lot, actually. I want to try the torch this time. See what happens with it. So let's put the torch in our hand. And go for a dive here. Holy cow, that, that sucks. I just... Hammerhead. Oh, he got me. How bad is it? It's not that bad. Yeah, I'm okay. Wow, that totally sucked. So it was a hammerhead that got me. Alright. Well, let's stow this. That was weird. It had a weird circle look to it. I need to put this vehicle part away too. Thought I had more of those. He's kind of trying to declare war on me, isn't he? I think we might have to go to war with this this guy. Okay, let's just put this filter part in there. And yeah. We'll put our torch in there. And grab the lantern. But right now it's just not safe to uh, 
get out of the boat. Even though we're right over top of this. So maybe I'll go on back to here to the base and rest until morning. At least until we can see better. Because right now, I don't see him until he's on top of me. You know, he's probably a lot more aggressive at night. A lot more confident. So let's put the sail down. Let's attach ourselves to the rudder so we don't fall off. Let's go. And then we're just going to circle back around here. And we'll come back to this one in the morning. I might just stow these uh, containers over here next to my next to my base camp in case I need them. But we'll come back for that one. The hammerhead took a little nibble out of me, man. All right, this is gonna be a little tougher to. Probably don't need to go all the way over here. I could probably just dock it over here. And then run around on the island here. And we're probably in the shallows there. That's a pretty good parking job. All right. Good stuff. Let's put our sail away for now. Let's grab both of these. And grab that one. And that one. Yeah. If we're If we're going back... We'll just leave these here for now. Let's see, I gotta figure out where my. Yeah, is he coming after me? Maybe. Yeah. I think our shelter should be over here somewhere, isn't it? There it is. I can probably stack these up and make myself a nice little safety place to stay away from the. Stay away from the. Oh, no, you can't. Yeah, okay. I was going to say I could stand up there and use that as a perch to attack the crab if, or stay away from the crab. Either way. So, what time of the night is it? The moon seems pretty high in the sky, so I'm guessing we're about halfway through the night. So let's see if we can sleep through it. Take a look at our stats. Not too bad. And we can go back and get some more water as well. Maybe make some uh, leather flasks this time. So I think, yeah, we'll see if we can guide ourselves back to our island successfully before we get into some dire straits with uh yeah let's sleep until morning hopefully with the water situation and stuff like that oh yeah it's always nighttime you never sleep through the that's a, one of my biggest pet peeves about this game is you never really sleep through the night until sun up this guy is such a light like not a light sleeper he's just doesn't sleep much okay there's our boat over here now yeah, the sun is starting to come up at least Let me grab another stick here how many of these yeah, let's craft up another one of these and I think you need like eight of these to kill a shark or something they might have different amounts depending on the shark again since I last played we only had one type of shark now there's a whole bunch of different types. So, before we head out, let's let's go over there and see what that had for us. And then we really won't have to come back to this island, I don't think. Maybe we got a couple little places to check, but... Here, let's uh, go sail down. Let's turn our boat. Try not to step on anything nasty. Let's turn our boat. There we go. All right, go for it. Technically, I should have put the rudder or the anchor back down until I got onto the rudder just to be extra safe. This is so much easier to, to pilot now with all these boxes gone. Now, when they were over here, that's kind of how it was with these stacked up. They were, like, right here, and I couldn't see anything to the left or to the right. It's like I was looking through blinders. And it was really frustrating. All right, let's go over here see what we can find. Hopefully, that's not a, the, sh the hammerhead yet again. Okay, so sort of threading a needle here. See anything in there? 
don't see any bubbles. I don't see anything in here either. Okay. Where are the bubbles? Did I miss it? Did I go the wrong way? There's the, it's the one where the mast was sticking out of the ground on the boat. Oh, it's way on the other side of the island. Somehow, somehow I went the wrong way. Well, it's obvious that I've been at this island. That's for sure. See those boxes all stacked up there. Okay, let's try this again. Just giving you guys a nice little tour of the island on a catamaran. It's my it's Acurize's catamaran tours. Yeah, at least it's a beautiful day. Beautiful day for sailing. Okay, so I'm not... S oh yeah, I am seeing bubbles there still, so... Barely. These bubbles are really hard to see. That's the thing. On this really calm day. I think at nighttime it's easier to see. Okay, I see them. I see them. Barely. They're right here. I don't see them right... Oh, there they are. They're back. Okay, right here. We're about to be on top of them. Yeah, it's some sort of a ship. Oh, the hammerhead is all over this thing. It's got to be something good if he's, if he's guarding it this closely. It makes me want to... Makes me want to just kind of try to spearfish him, get him out of the area. Maybe it's worth a shot. I got one hit on him, I think. We'll see. Yep. Oh, I missed on that one. Let's see if he comes back. No, I got I got two on him. It looks like. Maybe three now. That one might have been a little bit low. Oh, I got definitely got him there. Oh, he's starting to get pissed. Look at him. Did you see him circle back in? Yeah, he's he's looking like a pincushion at this point. How many is he going to take? Life is not going good for him right now. I couldn't take the shot there. The sun was glaring off of the water. Completely collected it. Oh. I didn't want to waste the spear on that one. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. My last spear. Make it count. Come on. Well, we should see him coming at least. Alright, I'm going to head down here. Have my Axe ready to go. Kind of want to try to jump in the water and hit him with the axe. Yeah, you can definitely see him. Alright, let's get down here. Get inside. Well, he's a lot easier to see. That's for sure. We got another shark out there? Is that what that is? Two sharks, maybe? I don't know. Let me get some air. Get down into here where we're safe. Yep, it's nothing. It's just an empty box. After all that. I saw some booby balls up there. And I know I can collect those, but... Alright, let's take a peek around. See where he's at. Where's he at? Where's he at? <laughs> there he is. Well, that's going to be fun. When we get back to our, our base, we can do some shark hunting. I've sort of got practiced up here a little bit. I don't know what the hunting leveling up does. Uh, I was trying to hit him. Maybe I can break these buoy balls up. Real quick here. There we go. Get to the other side. Opposite side of where he was. Get on here. They should be floating now. Okay, wait for him to pass. They said you can put these in your inventory. Here he is. Don't want to turn my back on him. Oh, I'm, 
trying. I'm trying, folks. He's got to be like one hit at this point. He, he, he turns every time. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I can actually stand on this? Oh, that's awesome. Maybe I can f just face him like this. I don't know if he'll come. Let's see, he's gonna come at me? No, he, he moves, he moves every time. All right, come on. Come on, where are you at, Spikey? That booby ball's heading over that way. Well said, well said. Alright, let's stand up. I need... I'm trying to last the Mohicans. Jump attack this guy here. Alright, come on, come on, come on. Come, on, come close, come close. Come, 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 come. <laughs> it does make it a lot easier to see him. Okay. I don't know if they even do damage. Uh, wow. I don't even know if they do damage. All right, let's go get the buoy ball. That was an interesting experiment, but uh, let's go get that last buoy ball. On the rudder. Now bring up the anchor. Let's go get it. Well, we try, guys. We could always go back to back to the camp and get more and kill them, but I don't I don't really need the meat right now. What I do need to do is head back to base and offload what we got. And we'll head back out this way once we get replenished on some... Is he following me? Oh, he is. <laughs> All right. Let's see if I can pick this thing up here pretty quickly. I think I hit it. Yeah, there it is. There we go. We got it. So they do stack. Oh, they do stack nicely. Okay, guys. Good tip there in the in the comments about the buoy balls. They're not the same as the uh, as the tires, which can't can't stack. Oh, you know what? Hold on, hold on. Let's before we start going crazy, just sailing around randomly. Let's make sure that we are going the right direction. So we're gonna go 340, and we are going the complete opposite direction. So let's head back, basically straight that way. All right, I got you. I wish I could have my compass out as I was using the rudder. Like, rudder in one hand, compass in the other, but it is what it is. Once we get straightened out here, come around here. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. We touch tips. That's fine. No big deal. Oh, this is a different shark. This is, this is Big Mama. I don't know if that's a bull shark or can't tell. It kind of looks like a bull shark to me, but it might be great white. It's definitely following us though. And it looks like, oh, this is the same boat. So we're not going to worry about that. I think I basically needed to head sort of this direction. Let me get off the anchor or off the rudder carefully and take a quick look. So I need to go that way a little bit more. So I need to go one o'clock basically. Once I get around the island. Oh, there's a rock right in front of us. It'll knock things off our boat. Okay, so 340. There we go. I think we're good now. Let's just... Alright, double check here. 340 heading. Pretty much where we're heading. That, that's, that's pretty good. Alright, and we're off, folks. We are off. Bye-bye, Adventure Island. It was fun. Yeah, there's my... Here's my shelter pointing me this direction anyway, so. Well, that was interesting. Learned a little bit about hunting. I think I was maybe one or two hits away from killing that shark. He's, I mean, how many more spears do I have to put in this guy, right? different hammerhead this time. A lot of sharks in these waters. Wish I had a grenade. Make life interesting.
Alright, so I just got the message that he needs to find water. Yeah, he does. So we're going to use one of our... Yeah, these are all empty. So, we're going to use one of our rations. As soon as I find them here. I think they're over here, actually. There we go. We use one of these rations. That helped. Good stuff. And we will double check our heading. Now's a good good time to do that. So 340, we need to head that way a little bit more. So let's adjust our course just a little bit. While on our, on our way back, I saw some bubbles over here, and I saw this huge ship, so I want to go explore it real quick. I'm pretty sure that's our island right there on the left side of the screen. That looks like our island. So I'm we probably already checked this island, but I'm just going to double check just to make sure we're not passing anything valuable. Yeah, we've already been here. We've got the, uh, we got the shelter set up here. But I'm going to double check these bubbles just for giggles. And there he is, again, the hammerhead. Alright, let's put the sail away here. He's an angry shark, isn't he? Let me take a quick look here. Nope, there's, there is a... He got me. Got a bite on me. Gotta try to face him best I can. <coughs> Take a look here. Yeah, we're hurting a little bit, but we'll be, we'll be all right. So I'm not sure what we have here. Let's take a quick look. Oh, we got ourselves a vehicle engine part. Okay. So that was a good find. Let's make room for this. Okay, let's pick this one up and drop it over here somewhere. We want to make sure that we stow this one properly. There we go. These two should be empty. Okay. Just stack them here. Best I can. I could probably put it off the side. Keep my visibility clear. A little more to the front. There we go. That looks decent. Alright, let's put the sail down and get back on track. Let me get myself my bearing again. 340. Yeah, that look, uh, that's going to be our island right there. I'm 99% sure. It looks exactly like it. So, let's head over here and make sure we're not missing anything. See anything obvious? Yeah, the door's open there. I'm pretty sure we've already searched this one. Oh, there's tires. Well, we're not going to grab those. Those will just weigh our watercraft down. Alright, so this should be our island right here in front of us. It's good to find that engine part, though. I think we needed that. I don't think we had one. Glad I got the hunch just to go check that those bubbles out. I mean, because even though we got bit by the shark... Uh, it was worth it. Those, sh the, those sharks attack so fast, and they just, like, never give give up, it seems like. It used to be that they would disappear for a while, and then only when you lingered in the water, then they would come back. It doesn't seem to be the case anymore. Alright, so, looks like we're making it back to our island just at sunset. Beautiful sunset. And there it goes. Green flash. Sort of. I should see the uh, lanterns on top of this, the roof of this sunken boat here, but they don't really have that much range. They don't oh, there they go. Okay, that looks like that looks like light. So I think we made it back, guys. I think we made it back safely. All right, that's an encouraging sign. It's been a very good episode for us so far. Didn't fall off the ship once while it was traveling. For me, that's 
That's A+. Plus. All right. A nice, friendly, welcoming light to guide us home. Let us know that, hey, don't run into this. It's starting to get a little uh, choppy out there. Okay, we got buoy balls out here, and I'm not going to do it right now, but, yeah, we can go collect more of those as well. But I think we're going to offload first, and then maybe we'll make some more sections onto the raft with the buoy balls. So I'm going to park out front here. I know that there's that stingy thing over here, the poisonous stingy thing. So I don't really want to mess with that right now. And we'll try to get as close as we can here. Let's see if we can parallel park this thing. And the shark's right there. So this might be a good hunting spot right here for the shark. We're going to experiment with that in the morning for sure. Alright. Let's see here. What do I got? A bunch of buoy balls. Let's, let's put these buoy balls somewhere. There you go. Hey, welcome home. All right, let's go get something to drink. We're thirsty. Oh, I do have an engine part already. Okay. Well, now we have two. And I'm sure... Let's throw some fibers on here. Okay, and get something to drink. Much better. All right, we should start recovering from our injury there. Oh my gosh. Yucca, you've been busy. Uh, potatoes. Just gonna pick you. Pick you. And I think I wanna make a... I wanna make a fuel, fuel still next, probably. I gotta organize this place. I'll probably do this off camera. I'll organize this place up a little bit better. That's been driving some of you OCD folks. It's a little crazy. But, uh... I'll drop these potatoes right here. And let me make sure that the potatoes still had water. Yeah, it's half, half, and half. Let's, let's, uh... Okay, let's, uh... Use our flask here. There we go. Give you a little water. Switch. Give you a little water. Empty, empty. They're both empty? I only had two? I had three. Okay. Well, we can solve that problem real quick. There we go. Gotta keep them hydrated. Gotta keep them happy. Right, I'm gonna drop these over here. I know I said get organized. And, yeah, there is three flasks. Oh, I was holding one in my hand. That was the problem. I guess they're all empty. All right. Fair enough. So, yeah, I will get this all organized offline. I promise one of these days I'll, I'll get around to it. Food, drink, everything's looking good. Let's all organize this. That's it. that's okay. That one's not going to hurt us. What do we got here? This one's empty. Grab you. Grab you. Grab you two. I think it's... Now I could have grabbed two more, but that's okay. I have to find a place to put all these boxes. Box Beach is not working anymore. I might, I might just like put them over here, like so, and just start stacking them four high, and labeling them accordingly. So resources, parts, uh, that sort of thing. What do you guys recommend? What should I use for my labeling? Is there something that really works nicely for you that you just can't live without? If so, let me know. Let me know in the comments. Yeah, that one's empty. Alright, so we've emptied our ship out here. It's uh, docked nicely. The anchor is down. Just double checking. I know it would have already drifted out pretty far had it not been, but I'm paranoid about these things. We've got some rocks in here we can definitely get rid of. Four there. Maybe another four. Maybe another one here. So yeah. Vehicle parts. Yeah. See, this is all just 
spread out. Like, it's just the way we found it, kind of, basically. Because I pretty much grabbed these and just took off. Oh, no more room in inventory. Okay. Let's check out what we need for this fuel still. I'm just going to drop engine parts here. And put our torches over here. And the lantern. It's kind of nice. I kind of want to just keep one here. For just the ambiance of it all. I'd like to be able to... Can I hang it? It would be nice to hang it up here on your shelter. I wish it would let me, but it's not going to. So... I think we'll just have to maybe... Maybe we'll just put it on our raft here. We'll let you... Not really. That's upside down. Will you stay there? No, you're touchy. You're... You're touchy about things, aren't you? Oh, there we go. Alright, that's not too bad. Let me grab these. I am going to get my containers organized. I didn't think so. I didn't think so. I don't want to put them on top of the plants that are going to grow up, though. That's the thing. Okay. Let's see if I can just drop them sort of like right here. Nope. I'm landing them on the top of this. That's not working. Get out of here. Oh, I didn't mean to... Th ah! I didn't mean to throw you into the deep. Don't step on anything poisonous. There we go. I'm sorry. That was my fault. Kind of okay. Ish. I don't know if it'll survive a windstorm. Starting to get these organized a little bit. I think four highs. Nice. Bunch of cloth. Yeah, we can throw all that into one. Label it cloth. Let's grab our label maker. You know what? Let's not do that. I, I'm going to do that offline. Alright, let's see what we got here. When it comes to crafting things here. A look at the vehicles. Gyrocopter. So I need a gyrocopter part. We have not found that yet. Gyrocopter part. Engine. We have these right there. We have this. So we need we need three gyrocopter parts and the hammer. That's what we gotta find. So we have got to be looking for these gyrocopter parts. And we need to be level six. I, I'm not sure exactly what level we are. Is there an easy way to tell? Should be. F, maybe? Let's see here. Let's go through our stats here. Uh, building. Can't tell what those are. They don't really label them. I don't know what fist means. What is that? Fight the power? Okay. But we're healthy. That's what matters. I should have showed you guys that a while back. Alright guys, well, I think we're going to end this episode here. We made it back to our island after a little adventure. We need to go out and get three gyrocopter parts, and then we're in business. Oh, I did want to check and see what a fuel still required. I'm sure we have enough for it, so let's just double check here. It's probably going to be under consumables, maybe? Maybe not. Shark repellent. I should probably make one of those. Oh, I need to get a lionfish? I don't think I've even seen one of those. An antidote and a coconut flask. So... Okay, that's probably what I need when I start doing some of these dives. A water skin. We need a tanning rack. Leather. That's not a problem. And a wood stick for the water skin. So we need to look at a tanning rack also. Okay, let's see here. These look like all... Yeah, those are all decorations except for the... Yeah. Container sh shelf, which we've already made. I guess that means you've already made one with the check mark. That's sort of nice. A water... Here we go. Hobo stove, water mill, or water... Water still. Plank station. 
that seems like that would be nice to have. If you really want to make a large... Yeah, tanning rack doesn't take much at all, really. Wow, we can make that no problem. Heal still, here we go. So I need clay. I, can, I know where that's at. I need some plank scraps. We're going to make a plank station, I think, first. Then we can make a planks. Oh, it's going to eat up one of my jerry cans. Oh, goodness. But we need it. So we can get started on that. It will eat up a jerry can, though. And we only have one of those. All right, so that's where we stand now. So I think plank station's next. Uh, tanning rack for the for the water leather flask or the pouch leather water pouch and then we need bricks we need clay we can make a lot of this stuff actually I need to get started on crafting some of this stuff around here alright guys we'll do that in the next episode thank you so much for watching like comment subscribe you all take care starting to get this place cleared out a little bit we'll put these potatoes to good use eventually and we got a bunch of rocks over here too and these buoy balls but uh should be able to st store these buoy balls, right? Yeah, we'll find a spot for them. There we go. How about this? There we go. We've got more out there to get. So, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Y'all take care.